Hey guys, what is happening? I'm outside of this restaurant and they have their own vending machine selling their products. It's a Nagoya family restaurant chain called Sagami. They feature these chicken wings that I really want to try. And they've got some other things as well too. Some different noodle dishes. These, this is the chicken wings right here. Looks pretty amazing. Maybe try some of these as well too. This is a uh, a dish that's served over rice. Noodles up here. And then they've got a dessert here. So I guess we'll try, we'll try one of each, shall we? Yeah? Okay, let's get into it. Let's do the uh, chicken wings first, number seven. Thousand yen. It's about seven dollars US, pretty good price, I think. Beautiful packaging, look at that. How many do you get in there? Ten? Say so, yes, yeah, it's ten. You get ten of them. Okay. And let's try this here. This looks really unique, doesn't it? It's got a miso soup kind of inside it. Number three. Price is 640 yen. Serves one. Same as the picture. Pretty similar. Yeah, so a miso flavor. Sweet. You can see some of the noodles there. Does it come with all the vegetables too? A pack of something in there. Okay. And then let's try this rice dish right here. This serves two people for 1,080. Number eight, is it available? Yes. Beautiful packaging, huh? Look at that. That looks really good. Yes. Okay, and dessert time. We gotta do dessert, don't we? This one right here. What kind of dessert is that? Kastara, kast the dessert is the most expensive item. It must be good, huh? Got just enough left to buy it. Number five. I'm short a little bit. I'm short 100 yen. We got 100 yen to get some extra support here. We do, we have another 100 yen. It is the grand dessert. It's called Tokachi Castellana. That's what it looks like. Beautiful. Alrighty. Looks like uh, another restaurant here. The restaurant's closed, but they've got a vending machine. Sells meat, bowls of noodles. This one looks good. Is everything available? Pretty much. Let's do this one. Looks nice. Number three. I don't know exactly what it is, I'm gonna get it. Which is often the case with vending machines. You know, it's a bit of a gamble. That's all you get? Huh. Never feel like I get ripped off though, you know, never. Almost never get ripped off. I think I think this would be good. Okay, get some meat here. Which one? Uh, this one. You this one? Yeah, yakiniki. Let's see. We've done the tongue enough times. Harami, meat. Yeah. Okay. For fifteen hundred.
Okay, so there's the meat. Looks exactly the same as the last one. And let's do one more, shall we? Try this one. Yureru dake. Skemen, I think, with kimchi. It's a Korean dish. Okay. Thousand. Number eight. And this one, you can see it. Oh, the noodles. Thin noodles. This is going to be interesting. Oh, yeah. And action. Do we nail it? No. <laughs> and action. Alrighty, I'm being joined by... Megabrain6100. Welcome, Megabrain6100. What's the 6100 for? It's from a show. Oh, it's from a show. Watch. That's right. Home Improvement. That's right. <laughs> Everything in the show had a 6100 after it. Everything that they advertised. Anyway, we're not here for that. We are here for the meal time. So, Kampai? Okay. I'm having our house beer, which is real rich malt by Santori. I'm having milk. Enough head on there? Do we get enough head on there? Sloppiest pour ever. Oh my gosh, you know why? It's because there's ice in there. If Beware, if you're pouring beer into a glass with ice, you're going to get a lot of head. All right, cheers. Cheers. Mouthful of foam. <laughs> that was delish. <laughs> Different. That's cold though. All right, so we have got quite a few interesting things here this evening. Noodles, meats, different kinds of meats, different kinds of noodles, some rice dishes, and a chef salad. Oh, and a superb dessert. That's nice. We think it's going to be superb, not really sure. Where would you like to start, Mega? The harami. The harami, you're gonna go for the meat. And harami in English is skirt steak. Look at this gorgeous plate of skirt steak. This might just be the best thing on tonight's menu. Yeah. It might be, not really sure. And this is served pretty thick. It's served kind of steak style, thick. Typically in Japan, steak is really thin. Okay, going in. It's got a sauce on it already. Oh. Mm. What do you think? Nice and tender. Tender and juicy. Yeah. Yeah, it's tasty. Or we'll come back to that later. So we've got some other meats too. We don't want to eat too much meat from the get-go here. Okay. Next up, this is calling me the tebasaki. Okay. The chicken wings. And I believe these are Nagoya style chicken wings. It's got the sesame seeds and what was that sauce that you put on them before? It's some kind of sweet sauce, I think. Sweet sauce, yeah. okay. We'll see. So chicken wings. You get quite a few. What do you get? Ten of them in here. Ten in the pack. That's pretty nice. Okay, finger foods. You can't really use chopsticks to eat chicken wings, can you? No. I don't think I've ever seen anybody do it. The breadiness is, um, it's very, what? <laughs> Uncrunchy. <laughs> I don't know, the chicken's nice, it's the, the breading is just kind of off, or different. <clears throat> Maybe try one more. Maybe we need to cook it a little bit more. Right? That could Maybe. be. Maybe. You gonna try another one? Yeah. Okay. It's nice with the sesame seeds. Yeah, 
sesame seeds are a nice touch. I like the sauce that's in. It's kind of a sweet sauce. Yeah. And the, the chicken is definitely juicy. It's just the skin. Could be a little crispier. Okay, you're up. You choose the next mega. The miso udon. Mm -hmm. <coughs> this is an interesting one. Very interesting. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so this is a really thick soup and the thick udon noodles. And this is definitely Nagoya style, right? Yeah. Miso. Okay, I got mine over my plate. The, probably the thickest soup I've ever seen with udon. So thick. I mean, right? That is super thick. All right, go on in. Oh, that's rich. That's so rich. What? I like a beef and miso stew. But the noodles are really nice. I mean, I like it. It works. If there were some chunks of beef in here, it'd be nicer. But but we've got the beef on the side. So and the other, the other dishes with meat in them. So this is it's just fine. It's got a smokiness to it, doesn't it? Yeah. The soup is excellent. Mm-hmm. Excellent indeed. Let's do one of the rice dishes, shall we? Okay. You want to do the chicken or the pork? The chicken. And this is also Nagoya style, right? Yeah. So it looks like similar breading, doesn't it? And that's a raw egg on top of there? It is. Do we mix that in? I think we do, right? Yeah. Raw egg yolk on top. What do you guys think? Meh. <laughs> <laughs> like a chicken nugget, isn't it? It's a chicken ball. Not a chicken egg, but look at this. Chicken meatball. Chicken, okay, chicken meatball, well said. Oh, it's like skin. Yeah. Oh, it's nice. Very good. Wow. I like that. Much better than the chicken wings. Um, it's a chicken meatball. Wow. And there's, if there's a skin here too that's separate? Yeah. Or it's just a different kind of... Different kind of meat, right? With the rice. It's real good. It's nice, I like it with the egg and there's onions in here. Right, there's grilled onions. Yeah. It goes nice with the with the rice. There you go. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give <laughs> <laughs> kind of reminds me of Pork katsu, like katsudon yeah. with the egg. It's similar. It's similar, so it's like, yeah. Like a chicken katsudon. I think so over the rice. Because it's got the egg in it, too. It's also got cooked egg in there as well, too, doesn't it? Yeah. So, two types of it. it had the egg, the raw egg as a topping, and then there was cooked egg that's blended in with the chicken. So, all served over rice and with the onions on it. Nice. And a good sauce and a sweet sauce. Very nice. Yeah. Moving on, you choose next. The Ru Rohan. Say that again. Ru Rohan. Ru Rohan, which I believe is, it's a stewed pork, and this one's also served over rice. That looks good. That looks almost like bacon. Yeah. Yeah, go ahead, go for it. All right. I'm gonna try the pork first. Oh, sweet, like Chinese style. Fatty pork. Oh, you know what I mean, though? It's got that sort of, there's a shoyu and a sweetness, too. Yeah. Real fatty. It's it's like Chinese style, though, isn't it? It tastes to different. Me. Yeah. I can tell by the spice. Yeah. Ru Rohan, it's called, huh? Ru Rohan. Got it. I like it. It's pretty good. Flavored really well. So nice to be in Asia, isn't it? Yeah. That's that's the nice thing about, well, being in Japan, that you know, we have really good access to Chinese food, Korean food, all other Asian foods, which right within Japan, which is nice. So, legit. All mixed into one meal. That's what you get when you eat from vending machines. <clears throat> you never know what you're going to get. Right? It's fun. 
Yeah, uh, <laughs> it doesn't always go together the best, but we we do as well as we can with it. All right, we got one more left here. What was the Japanese name for it's this? It's called Maimen. And they're transparent green bean noodles. Excuse me. I was going to say green pea noodles. Isn't that amazing? Made from green beans. I'll get some you can eat from the dish. Okay. And they're slippery. Very slippery. And I notice a smell. It, the, the soup has a smell. Yeah. More so than anything else on the table here tonight. What is that? Excuse me. What is that smell? Like tonkotsu? Maybe. Yeah, it could be the, yeah, like the pork broth soup. I don't know. Go on in. Mmm. And it should be noted that this one you eat cold. Yeah. Right? So it's a more, more almost like a, what? A, it's a cold soup, basically. I think this should be eaten more as a salad. I like it, though. And uh, the soup, the noodles are super, super long. <laughs> I can tell you that. I think the noodles and are chewier. And they slide right off the chopsticks. Chewier than there we the go. ramen, I think, because it's cold. Oh, is that, is that why? Okay. Yeah. And then the soup, the smell is more overpowering than the taste. The taste isn't that bad, right? It's a, it's a, it's, yeah. it's, it's, a, it's a salty, right? Salty taste. Right, shio, salt. And the noodles really slippery. They're cold, Mega Fest. I think he's right. Okay, and we're gonna finish off the meal with the salad. <laughs> Forgot to eat the salad, didn't we? <laughs> but we have a fascinating dessert item too. So okay, let's do the salad. Chef salad. This is the only thing that didn't come from the vending machine. This and the drinks, right? Yeah. Okay. So you go ahead, pick and choose what you want there. Who wants to wager that Meg is not going to take any tomatoes? <laughs> We're trying to get him going on tomatoes. I'm going up. Oh, I just want a lot of ham. Okay. Was I right? Didn't even go for one half of a cherry tomato. That'll be the day, huh? And we've got dressing here. Oh, I smell, smell that. Oh, I smell the vinegar. The vinegar. This looks powerful. I smell like onions. It's an onion and vinegar dressing. And something else. Looks good. Smells good. Okay, going in for our chef salad. Got some dark leafy greens here. Oh, those cherry tomatoes. So juicy. And sweet. Yeah? You tasting those? No. No? How about those chicken bones there you got on the side of your plate? What do those taste like? <laughs> I like the ham and the black olives. Yeah. Are you ready for dessert? I'm ready. Okay, so you remember what this is called? It's, it's an called, Italian Italian dessert. It's called Catarana. Catarana? Yeah. Not Catacana? Catarana. Catarana. Okay, and let's see if we can I get... I think it's similar to pudding. Oh, pudding, okay. Yeah. An Italian pudding. All right. Oh yeah, it kind of looks like a like a Japanese pudding. Maybe spoons, chopsticks for pudding. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Okay, get in there. And there's what it looks like. Okay, ready, Maga. Yeah. All right, let's do this. Oh, oh my! Oh. oh my gosh, that's sweet. Sweetest pudding ever. But it's got that like caramel, sort of crispy caramel on top and syrup. It's amazing, right? Taste the eggs. 
I'm very rich. It's so good. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh. It's such a thick pudding. <sighs> wow. Um, from a vending machine. Oh my goodness. Look at him go, ladies and gentlemen. Look at him go. So I think for overall variety this evening, we had two noodle dishes. We had two meat dishes over rice. And then a side of meat and another side with the, uh, the chicken wings. The salad. And I think it was pretty balanced, actually. Yep. <clears throat> oh. We just weren't quite sure what everything exactly was. I mean, the, the taste and the flavors of everything were quite unique. I'll say that. So we weren't really knowing what to expect. Especially with the chicken wings. Oh, my gosh. Bizarre. <laughs> Okay, so on the rating scale between one and six of your mega heads, where are you gonna go today? I'm gonna go five. Five out of six? Okay, what did you like the best? The katarana. The dessert. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna say I liked the skirt steak the best. Followed by the miso udon. That was pretty fabulous. Yeah. And, and even the glass noodle, I liked the, the cold noodles too. Different from what I normally eat as far as noodles goes. So I will go five as well. Five out of six. That's uh, it's banging. It's banging. It's banging. And the yeah. dessert too. Yeah, very nice. So that's going to do it for this one. We'd like to thank you guys for watching. Eric and Mega out. <laughs>